Okay, so the next drill we're going to get into is planks. Okay, okay. so I, I really have shied away from the traditional sit-up because it's very two-dimensional. Okay, you're only activating muscle groups in one direction and it's not a completely functional exercise. Whereas the plank creates a lot of stability and requires you to fire a lot of the muscle groups. Right. Uh, and then again, starts to prepare you for much more advanced movement. Okay. okay. So um, we're going to employ a lot of things that we've already done. Some of the light po posterior pelvic tilting okay. and then the pelvic contractions right. while we're in this position. Okay. okay. So in order to protect your body and your shoulders, mm -hmm. okay, we'll start, we're going to start with the elbow planks. Okay. okay? So I'm going to have you place your elbow in here directly underneath the shoulders. Okay. okay. All right. And as you get into position, I'm going to actually have you keep your head in a neutral position. Okay. So you're basically going to be looking at the floor. Okay, because if you look up, you're going to put your head in an extended position right. that and cranks on yeah, your neck. Yeah, I can That's feel that tension yeah. there. Yeah, okay. So what we're going to do is have you kick your feet out. Okay. okay, good. Bring your butt down a bit. Perfect. Squeeze those glutes. Pull your navel into your spine. Perfect. Okay, and then try to breathe normally through your nose, in through the nose, out through the mouth. Okay, good. And then you can come on okay. down. So uh, what I would recommend if somebody's not familiar with that, just try getting into the position and then coming out. And then also, as you get stronger, then build up some time there. So okay. five seconds to 10 seconds. Ultimately, um, uh, you know, you should have some good strength where you can hold it up to a minute to two minutes. Okay. okay. So the other, uh, another position that you can achieve the plank is on your hands, which is basically the push-up position. Okay. So same thing, you're gonna put your hands directly underneath the shoulders, shoulder, shoulder okay. width apart. Yep, okay. same thing, head looking straight ahead. You're gonna kick your feet out. Good, okay, squeeze the glutes. Good, perfect. And tighten up the abs. Okay, perfect. And done. Okay, so I am gonna segue just a little bit because uh, we find this kind of often. Um, people tend to do um, the quote unquote girly push ups, and I don't like to call them that. Yeah, we don't um, like you calling them that. We don't like that, yeah. <laughs> so, so basically, a regressed form of the push ups, okay? People like to do them uh, on the knees like this, okay? Well, this isn't really a great position because you really cannot activate the glutes. Okay, right. so rather than trying to do push-ups on your knees, try and find a surface on the wall or on the steps because you can find that elongated position where, again, when your legs are extended, this is hip extension, okay, and basically you can start to fire up those glutes mm -hmm. when you're in that position there. Okay. So I just wanted to add that because it's a, a common thing that I see, and uh, again, for movement purposes, it's not the ideal thing for activating what we need in our body. Great. Okay, Thank great, you. excellent. Boom! What's up everyone? Mark Lobliner, TigerFitness.com, alongside my man Dr. Stu um, with his formula, Machine Motion, the Dr. Stu series. Dr. Stu, what's up with this, man? Uh, so we designed this uh, formulation, it's a joint formula, okay, to kind of support the, the book that we came out with for low back pain, right? And so we want to support the health of joints uh, for people that are just ailing. And uh, we put a short little, uh, a, a compact little uh, formulation together and put everything together that everybody has kind of separated into different products. So it's an all-in-one. Um, there's a link in the description below. You can click on that, find out a little bit more information. And uh, there it is. Thing is, you're looking at scientifically validated dosing of key ingredients to help not only if you have lower back pain, but any kind of joint issues or if you want to prevent them. And that's not a game.